Good morning. I'm Abby McSweeney, and I am not used to being up here, as I am much more of a stay-in-the-background sort of person. But somehow, despite that, Lisa's eye found me, and she asked me to serve on the vestry. <laughs> While considering, I decided that I could find the time and the willingness to serve, but I wondered what else I could bring to the table, as my skills lie in unglamorous background things. Previously, I was a biology lab research manager, where alongside the bench work, the job included background things like preparing reagents and ordering supplies and keeping track of paperwork, the kind of things that you don't notice unless they don't get done. When I became a mom, I realized that it required the same skill set. I was just stocking diapers and Cheerios instead of pipettes. And in my time on Vestry, I found that in between the big jobs like calling a rector and dealing with building emergencies, the vestry helps make sure that things in the background are running, including being good stewards of our church finances. Back in our grad student days, Tom and I didn't have a lot of extra time or money to give, so we tried to pick charities where our modest donation might make more of a difference. Things like the local food bank that could take that money and multiply it into dozens of meals, or a local charity that provided small grants and loans to people experiencing temporary financial hardship. Maybe not as glamorous a cause as saving the environment or curing disease, but still something needed. More recently, after moving to Williamsburg, we've had more money to give, yet we've still tried to find places where our donation will make more of an impact, including our pledge to St. Martin's. While St. Martin's is blessed to have the endowment to provide revenue for new and ambitious ministry initiatives, as well as a reserve fund to cover unexpected expenses, hello, mold remediation, it is the operating budget that covers the day-to-day -day expenses of the church. And this is where you and your pledges come in. Because the vestry can only plan the church operating budget around the money that we know we have coming in. Your commitment to your pledge keeps the lights on and pays the salaries of our priests and staff and supports our many ministries, all of which makes a big difference at St. Martin's. Last year, with prayerful expectation, we stretched the budget for Lisa to call an associate rector, so we especially need your pledges now. So please consider what you can give each month to keep St. Martin's doing all the wonderful things that we are doing every day. And now it is time for me to fade into the background once more. Thank you. 